Hello, my name is Matt, and I'm addicted to Super Auto Pets. Yes, hello, fellow engineers, and welcome back to Super Auto Pets. We're having another go at this game where last time we maxed out a rhino, and it was it was very impressive, but we didn't quite get the 10 wins. Can we get it this time? Right, I think I'm going to start with an ant, and then we're going to roll. Oh, look, another ant. Perhaps I'll grab another ant, and then a beaver, and then we've spent all our money. We can go end our turn, but first we need to pick our names. We're going to be the obese hipsters. I've never actually seen an obese hipster. All right, who are we going to be facing first? We are facing the delicious fanboys. So there, Mosquito did some damage to our beaver, but look, he got double buffed by both my ants. However, this was a draw, so we don't gain any trophies, but we don't lose any hearts, so not, not all bad. All right, next up, I might buy another beaver. My aim here is to get three of the same so we can level someone up to level two, which will give us someone from the next tier. But I don't want to do that yet. I want to do that next time because next time we go up to tier two anyway. Uh, so I think we'll just roll. Oh God, we'll roll again. There you go. We got a beaver. We've got a beaver. Then we can roll one more time and there's nothing there we want for the future. So we'll just end our turn there. Beavers and ants fighting together side by side against beavers, otters and mosquitoes. Uh, I don't know who's going to win this. I feel like I should, but you never know. It's a draw. It's another draw. Okay, but now we've reached turn two. The tier two animals are unlocked and we now lose two lives per loss. Oh man, whenever I see the hedgehog, I'm always tempted. Hedgehog builds can be hilarious. I'll tell you what, let's level up these beavers and see what our next tier animal we get is. Oh, it's a kangaroo. I feel like that doesn't really work with the hedgehog. So what I might do, I might do a swan and kangaroo sort of thing. Kangaroo, we can shove you behind anyone. Let's roll. And then I'll tell you what, I might double up my ants and then just shove an elephant at the back. Uh, I don't usually like the elephant, but he's got five health, so he can take a bit of a beating. I do want to get that first win before we get too far into the game. So hopefully we might do okay. Okay, Ant v Otter. We killed him. Oh no, but now they've got a spider. Although, look, our kangaroo's pretty hench. Lovely. We didn't even use our last two, so we got our first trophy. Ooh, and look at this. Look at this. I'm literally just going to put the swans on so that we level up. Oh, we get a rabbit. Now, the rabbits can be okay. They're not my favourite, though. I might freeze and roll twice more. Honestly, I'm not really feeling any of that. I might just let's unfreeze the rabbit. I'm going to grab the meat bone and put it on the swan, I think. And the meat bone just does an attack for five damage more. So we'll be doing 10 damage each attack. Uh, I tell you what, I might even freeze the sleeping pill. I'm overthinking. I'm overthinking. Let's just end turn and see who we're up against. Oh, I tell you what, I should have moved my kangaroo behind the swan as well. All oh, right, they got a mosquito, so someone will take some damage. It was our ant. He's buffed the kangaroo. Every time the beaver attacks, our kangaroo gets stronger. Look, it's 7-7. Seven, seven. And nice. Elephant saves the day. All right, now we're at the good point. Tier 3 animals are unlocked. So we can put a kangaroo on the kangaroo. And then if we roll, I really want another kangaroo, basically. Or an ant. I just want to be able to level up once more. Oh, it's not going to happen, is it? Keep rolling. Keep rolling, 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 rolling. Yes, we got an ant. Okay, so we'll put the ant on there. Ooh, we've unlocked a dolphin. So I'll tell you what. I think I'm going to sell my elephant for one gold and replace him with a dolphin. And now the dolphin at the start of the battle does five damage to the lowest health enemy. Very, very useful, particularly this early in the game. So let's end our turn and we'll see who we're up against. Oh God, they've got lava background. That means they're good. And they're wearing hats. That's how you know someone's good. Anyway, we're sort of doing okay, I think. Oh no, we might not be. Oh, we might be. I think it could be a draw. No, they won because bloody cricket has an extra life at the end. We lost. So we lose three hearts. Thankfully, as we didn't lose any early on, it means we've still got three lives remaining because we don't lose any more than three hearts from now on. Uh, let's put the kangaroo behind the swan. Don't know what to do. I don't know whether to go to summoning build or what to do. I feel like perhaps we freeze the spider. We've got so many coins. We've got 12 coins. So let's roll. Okay, we've got two spiders now. Could definitely be an option. Ooh, the sheep. I think the sheep's better than the spider. So we'll unfreeze the spider and we'll freeze the sheep. I'm going to roll once more. I know this is this is getting a bit silly. Oh, God. Okay, look, we got a snail as well. So the snail, if you lost the last battle, which we did, it gives all friends two and one. So let's sell the beaver. He's going to give two random friends two health. Nice. I'm glad they went to the swan and the kangaroo. I think we're going to be sticking with them for a while. Uh, then we buy the snail and then everyone gets leveled up. Lovely. Then we sell the snail and then we buy a sheep and then we think about what we're going to do next. I think we're just going to roll once more. Ah oh, yes look. So now we got a sleeping pill and you'll notice 
if we kill this ant, it gives a random friend four and two. And I'm sort of happy with my team. I feel like we could go fairly far with these. So let's give the ant a sleeping pill. Oh, and he gave it to the dolphin. Nice. And we've now got three coins. So we can buy perhaps another sheep. If we put him there and the other one there. I think that should cause some issues for people. Because uh, if I put these at the front, because it summons two 2-2 two, two rams, it means only one would be there because there wouldn't be room. So you have to move them at least second in line. So okay, let's end our turn and see how we get on. The obese hipsters are facing the hot hikers. Oh no, they've got a deer. They've got a deer. Thankfully, yes, our dolphin destroyed the deer. Although this guy could cause us some issues. Looking okay right now, we will see the hedgehog. The power of the hedgehog. It's pretty scary. Scary, but it's a draw. And now we've reached turn seven. Tier four animals are unlocked. Uh, so not really feeling any of those. Let's roll. Oh, we got the deer. We finally got the deer. Okay, I don't think our kangaroo is the best, if I'm honest. So we might sell the kangaroo. Although we're going very summoning if we do that. I'd love another kangaroo to pop up so I can upgrade him before we do anything. So maybe I'll just freeze the deer. We'll buy the dolphin and then we'll roll again. Nothing good. Roll again. Oh dear. Right, five coins remaining. I think I can do it once more. I really need a kangaroo. Damn it. Okay, so... Ooh, however, we now have a dolphin, which we can buy him to level up. Although that does mean we can't then buy the deer. But I think that's worth doing. Oh, we've got a shark. That could be pretty decent as well. I was hoping we'd get the rooster. But a shark is really good with a summoning build because every time a friend faints, it gains two and one. So if you have them right at the back, because these two are like summoning two each. Like if you do the maths, this guy levels up quite a bit. So I think we'll freeze him. We'll freeze the canned food and then we'll roll once more. And yeah, nothing, nothing really worth doing there. So let's end our turn. We'll hope we do okay. This could be the last time we see our kangaroo in battle. So Swan, oh nice. So our dolphin destroyed the first one. Swan is going to rip through the team, hopefully. And look at our kangaroo. He's getting buff. Oh, oh. <laughs> Right, we absolutely smashed that round. Now we're up to three wins. All right, so now we buy the canned food, and then the people down here are a lot stronger. Do we get rid of the kangaroo? Do we get the shark? I'm not sure. Our dolphin now does 10 damage to the lowest health enemy at the start of battle. Now we leveled him up, by the way. Uh, or perhaps we should just make the sheep merge. Say so what, I'm going to roll. Oh, there's nothing too much. There's nothing too much. I wasted quite a bit now. Let's get rid of the kangaroo. This could be a mistake. Swap it with a deer. Do I go with the swan? I think I'm going to get rid of the swan soon. So I think we'll just roll. Ooh, a pair. All right, I think if I merge these two and then shove the shark at the back, he should get pretty strong throughout. So let's end our turn. Or do I freeze the pair? I might freeze the pair and see how we get on. So swan, are you still strong? Oh, it looks like he is. Although look... I think our shark's dead, yep, because they've got a crocodile. They deal damage to your last enemy. If I'd kept the dolphin there, it would have survived. Uh, we're in a bit of trouble now. Unless our dolphin can smash through all of these, which it can't, we have lost. We've lost. Oh, dear. Yeah, but now we've unlocked tier five animals. We've got a hell of a lot more chance of getting what we need. Oh, look, chocolate. Let's freeze the chocolate. And maybe we'll unfreeze the pair. Chocolate is way more valuable because it gives you like that experience. So I could level up my sheep. Really, I just need the rooster. Where are you, rooster? Once more. Okay, parrots are really good. I might even buy one and possibly get rid of our shark. Or maybe the swan. Do I need this much money now? Let's freeze the parrot. We'll think about getting the scorpion. Basically, the scorpion and does one hit kills but it's got very little amount of health maybe we'll freeze him and replace with the swan i feel like we should roll a few more times as we have so much money Ooh, another deer All right this is going to be super risky but i'm actually going to get rid of the swan for two gold i'm then gonna put another deer in i'm not gonna touch those two for now i don't think although i could level up the deer yeah maybe i'll do that so if i do that and then use the chocolate we've just gained a mammoth and when he faints all friends gain two and two I'll tell you what, that could be worth having at the start, particularly if we can get a mushroom, give him an extra life. That is an OP tactic. I think we might do that. Maybe we'll lose a scorpion. I don't really rate the scorpion, if I'm honest. It's a bit cheesy. So let's end our turn and see how we get on. Oh no, we're against background people. Oh, they got a big fish. So our mammoth is dead, but look, everyone gains two and two. And our bus now does splash damage and 10 attack every time. Uh, it didn't last long though. We're getting a little bit annihilated, although we should win this. Because look at our shark. He's a big boy. <laughs> right, fourth win. Nice. So I think we'll give us the sushi. That gives three random pets one and one. Nice. 
I want to buff up the mammoth if possible. Uh, I think we'll just do the sushi again, you know. Do we roll or do we use the salad bowl? Oh, look, the rhino's back. All right, I think we'll freeze the pair to give to either the mammoth or the shark. I might get rid of the parrot, you know. I'm not sure I'm going to use them anymore in this build. Do I add to the dolphin? Do I do canned food? I just don't know. Let's just keep rolling. Oh, look, another shark. If we get a level two shark, that could be very good. Let's freeze him and we'll keep rolling. Another deer. Oh, dear. I could actually get rid of the sheep for another deer. I'm going to freeze the deer and we're going to end our turn and see how we get on. So we are facing the subtle glasses. So look, our, our thing. Oh, yes. Yes, that's why the dolphin's so good. Because he does damage to the lowest enemy. Often it's that little scorpion. Because he would have one hit killed anyone. So our mammoth would have been gone instantly. But the dolphin saved the day. Uh, that is a henchworm though. Although nothing our underwater crew cannot deal. Oh, no, it's a draw. <laughs> a little bee killed a shark. All right, turn 11. Tier 6 animals are unlocked. It's just got serious. I think we do that to the shark and we can roll once more. Oh, look, chocolate. Ooh, okay, I think we we level up the shark, don't we? No, I think we do the shark. Let's get a really hench shark. Nice. So when someone faints now, he gains four and two. He is going to be a big boy. Uh, we could also give him melon armor as well, just to try and let him last a little bit longer. So maybe I'll freeze that. So let's end our turn and look who we're up against. These are quite easy team, I think. Although saying that, I'll probably lose now. Our mammoth is actually doing some damage and now he's buffed everyone up. The 1010 bus doing some splash damage. Uh, that is quite a hench kangaroo though. Uh, it's only got one health left. Nice. Oh, look how hench that shark is. 4126. Nice. And that's our fifth win. So now I'm going to give melon armor to the shark. Uh, and then I'm going to roll. I don't think I want to change my team. I'm quite happy with this. Do I do a meat bone to anyone? No, I think I'll keep rolling. Oh, look. We can level up our sheep. Shall we do it? I think we should do it. So our sheep now summons two 4-4 four, four rams. So even better. Uh, we've got two more coins. So we can roll twice more. I might freeze the melon. I think I'll freeze the melon. Let's roll. Oh, look. The mushroom. There there it is. There it is. We'll freeze a mushroom and I think we'll just roll once more like that. Nothing we want there. Right, let's end the turn. I'm feeling quite good about this. I'm feeling confident. So they've got a hench spider, so our mammoth is dead. Although look, we just killed their spider, which is quite useful. Oh god, what is going on? They've got a snake. He does five random damage every time. Ow. Right, thankfully he's gone. Now it's time for our rams to kill that. We're going to get killed and they've got a bee. We've lost. We've lost. Damn it. <laughs> All right, we got we got one heart remaining. Uh, however, look, we can give a mushroom to this guy. So now he'll come back and then he'll give all of our friends two and two again. Uh, I then might give melon armor to our sheep just because I feel like because he's got the lowest health, if anyone has a dolphin, he'll get hit. But the melon armor should stop him from fainting because the melon armor basically takes 20 damage less, but only once. And we then got four coins, so we'll do that. Ooh, and look, more melon armor. We could just be an absolute knob and melon up everything. I could shove it on the dolphin. I think I will. And then I'm going to freeze the chocolate and we could potentially get our deer to level three if we get lucky next time with a deer. But that's assuming we even make it to next time. So let's end turn and see how we get on. I'm a little bit scared, not going to lie. Oh no, they've got a hedgehog. That's going to wipe all of our melon armor. Oh, but look, they had... Oh, look, he's gone. Oh, the snake is a bit of a bastard, if I'm honest. But look, we've buffed up twice. So everyone's really hench now. And we won that one easily. Nice. We've got six wins, one life remaining. Oh, and it's the turkey. Finally. Right, question. Do I sacrifice my team at the moment? Get rid of the dolphin for a turkey. And then try and level it up. It's an option. I don't know if it's the right option. Maybe I freeze the turkey and give it one roll and see what we get. We got another dolphin. All right, let's think about this. Yes, yeah, so this guy does eight more damage than the turkey and has seven more health. And he has melon armor. But the turkey will give this three and three. So it will become a 13-13 bus. And then two of those, four and four, which become seven and seven. So that's going to give us an extra nine attack and defense. So I think the math sort of works out. I'm se I'm doing it. I'm selling it. I'm doing that. We've then sort of got two more rolls. I really want a turkey or another chocolate bar we didn't get it. Oh, although if we do the mammoth and then the chocolate on the mammoth, he now gives all friends four and four. Nice. Okay, let's end our turn. I don't think there's any point trying to level up the mammoth again. Deer, probably worthwhile. So we'll leave him frozen. Oh, this is our last life though. Could go either way. Oh, look at that fish. That is a hench fish. Thankfully, four and four. He gets three and three. They get all get four and four again. Oh man, there's... Come on, turkey. Oh no. <laughs> oh no. 
Oh, we've still got the fish to go. I think we've lost. Although, it's a draw. No, we've won. We actually won. I thought we were going to lose that. So we've got seven. We only need three more wins. Come on, we can do this. So let's give our pet some pizza. They get two and two. Nice turkey getting that. That's fine. We'll roll. Oh, nothing good there. We're going to roll. Oh, another heart. Another mushroom. I'll tell you what, it might be worth giving the deer a mushroom because then we get two deers. Uh, let's roll again and then roll again. Oh, look, chocolate. I think we'll freeze the chocolate in the hope that we can level up the turkey in the future. So let's end our turn. This is assuming we survive this round. But you'll see the deer with the extra life means another deer will come back, which means we get another bus as well. And they all get buffed by the turkey, which is quite nice. Although that is a 50-50 elephant. Quite terrifying. Oh god, and it's buffing the camel and the peacock behind. They're pretty strong right now. I don't think we're going to win this one. I've never seen someone use this technique. It's pretty good. So we can take him out. This is going to kill us though. Damn it! So yes, game over on turn 50. I feel like we did all right, though. We, we were getting there. And like all addictions, I want to have another go. So I'm going to go do that. Meanwhile, peace, love, and really buff sharks. And I'll catch you next time. Bye.